So I'll be showing you how to change the Wi-Fi network of your Google Nest camera. Now, in case you had set up your camera with a specific Wi-Fi network, and now you want to connect it to a different network, maybe because the one you have is unstable, or for whatever other reason you have, it's a very painful process because you have to actually reset and reset up your Google Nest camera. It's the only way to actually change the Wi-Fi network because when you reset the camera, it's going to erase all the data, including the connected Wi-Fi network. And then when you're setting up, you can also set it up with a new Wi-Fi network. So that is the only way to do it as at the date of making this video. So let's go through the process. So the first thing you want to do is go to the Google Home app on your Android or iPhone. So just go to Google Home, find the camera tile, tap on it, and then go to the settings wheel icon at the top there, tap on it, and then select remove device. Okay, so then confirm you want to remove the device. And that's going to remove or disconnect that device from your Google account and from your Google Home app, okay? Now, once you do that, the next thing you need to do is detach the camera from the magnetic plate. And once you do that, under the camera, you should see the reset button. So right here, just below the camera at the point where it attaches to the magnetic plate, you should see this little reset button. Now, this is a button you can press with uh, a non-sharp object. So maybe the tip of a, a matchstick or something. Anything really that can press this button without necessarily uh, destroying. Now, personally, I'm going to use this screwdriver head, this one. And what you need to do is press and hold that button in for about 12 seconds until you hear the camera make a sound. Okay, so just press and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I did not hear a sound. Now, let me try again. So again, press and hold and wait for about 12 seconds. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Now, I did not hear a sound, although I'll assume it's safe to, it to, I'll assume the camera has already reset, okay? Although I did not hear any sound. So, with the camera reset, you can now go uh, back and attach it to th the magnetic plate. And then once you do that, find the power cable and connect it to the power cable so that you can now start the uh, setup process. So let me just connect the power cable. Give it a couple of seconds. The light on the camera goes on. And this time it makes a sound, which means the reset was successful. Although it's still kind of strange that I didn't hear the uh, reset sound anyway. So the camera is back on and it's now time to set it up again. So again, go to the Google Home app and then tap on the plus icon and then tap on setup device and then tap on new devices. Select your home, tap on next and then it's gonna start looking for devices.
then if it doesn't find it choose camera and then choose your camera mine is the nest cam uh, battery so i'll tap on it and now that qr code that you saved when you were unboxing the camera for the first time comes in handy okay so here's mine and all you have to do is scan that qr code and once the code has been scanned you can now go ahead with the setup process now if you can't find your code or if for some reason you lost that qr code then you can watch my other video on how to set up a google nest camera without the qr code so i'll be linking that video in the description below anyway so while you're here choose your camera mine is this one and then tap on next and then tap on continue of course you have to agree to these terms read more tap on next privacy guidelines agree help improve nescom you can choose whether to agree or not and then tap on next next choose where you want to place your camera mine is actually mine is indoors so next now this is the important part when you're choosing wi-fi now previously i had connected it to this wi-fi gt spot 5g which is a 5g uh, band for my router but i found it to be unstable and that's why i'm changing to the 4g gt spot uh, wi-fi network so i'll choose that network and then tap on next and then enter that uh, wi-fi network's password and then connect connected there you go and then it's gonna finish up the setup process And then of course you can finish up the process by selecting uh, this stuff you can see the camera is already working and that's basically how to change the wi-fi network of your google nest camera it's a very uh, long and unfortunate process thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck